Now let's see who this ghost bear really is. Cookie? 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 Uncle Cookie? Why? WWE is your life. WWE was his life. But sadly, your Uncle Cookie never got the glory. And his injury put him out of the spotlight. Permanently. He started to truly resent WWE because he knew he could never be the champion he always dreamed of being. That resentment grew into hatred over the years as he trained others to be what he could not. That's when he developed his plan for revenge. But that wouldn't be enough. He needed a pawn to steal the championship belt. That's when he devised the idea of hacking into a video game and placing post-hypnotic suggestions into it. That game would become part of a contest, which Cookie set up with fake emails he sent throughout WWE. That's why he used the bear to attack your video game studio, to cover his tracks. The contest assured that only the most skilled pawn would arrive at WWE City to aid in the theft. Cookie then used flashing lights to activate Scooby's post-hypnotic programming. When Cookie identified the belt in Scooby's bed as the championship belt, he was lying. He'd already switched them. With Scooby taking the blame, Cookie was free to carry out his ultimate plan. Which was to turn out the lights and with the help of the bear, create so much panic and injury that WrestleMania would be completely ruined and WWE would never recover. But thanks to Fred here, we got the lights back on pretty quick. Good work. <laughs> uh, thanks. And the real championship belt. Where is it now? Elementary, my dear Mr. McMahon. Cookie's wearing it. Sorry, Cookie. But the championship belt isn't for cheaters, it's for champions. Kids, sir. I thought they might come in handy. Just get Cookie out of here. Yes, sir. We'll do, sir. You bet. The championship belt was the icing on the cake, Mr. McMahon. Cookie could live off its golden jewels for the rest of his life. And I would have gotten away with it too if it weren't for you meddling kids and your game crazy dog. I guess after what my uncle's done, you won't be wanting me around anymore. Not so, Ruby. You're one of us now. You got the funk, son! That's right, Ruben. You've shown a superstar spirit in the ring and at the computer. You've earned a place with us in whatever you want to do. The choice is yours. Thanks, Mr. McMahon. Now that we have the real championship belt, it needs to be awarded to true champions. And after what I've seen tonight, they're right here. Skinny Man and Dad Meat. Well done.